Hey there, this is Dhiraj Mishra and welcome to this video. In this video, we are going to talk everything about the Pravati exam, right? Previously, it was known as INSERT exam, which is organized by a study in India team for their applicants to be eligible for this study in India scholarship program. So, let's deep dive into this Pravati exam, criteria, syllabus, and the roadmaps you need to tackle this exam. So, I am an experienced guy. I have also gone through the same path you are going through and i will be sharing my experience the materials i have used and the website youtube channels everything i have used to pass to tackle this scholarship exam and one thing i would like to say very frankly before going to the video that during your time the cutoff marks maybe according to my analysis will be 70 plus out of 90 to for you to have the scholarship right so you have to of course study hard and prepare very well for this exam and one thing the syllabus is not very fast not very tough for you right so i'm going to discuss the syllabus and the roadmap so let's start this video this will not affect whether you are a 12 appearing student or 12 past student the most important thing that that will affect this scholarship is your probability score so let's talk about the need and how the exam will be conducted so the first thing is the exam will be held in online mode and the first important thing you need is a laptop or a pc with a active webcam during the day of examination so what happens is during the day of examination a study in the team will send you a link in your mail and the time slot for this test will be constant for every nation right so during the time slot you will open that link and you will be moved on to a special portal after you click that link nothing will open in your pc or laptop that is you cannot browse to any browser you cannot open any tab you cannot do anything in your pc your pc will be controlled by the study in the team ai and that portal right so this portal will be tracking your I retina to avoid the cheating during the examinations the microphone of your pc will be tracking the noises is there any person or anything that is speaking around you and if such things are found the study in india team ai will give you a notification or a message on your screen and warning to avoid these things and if this continue you will be banned from the examination in the midterm and we will not be eligible for this scholarship so be aware to have a peaceful room section while skater setups for what is described below the first section is having the verbal reasoning verbal reasoning generally means everything about related to english right so let's see what is it inside so reading comparison that is paragraph reading in our local language and that is fill in the blanks another thing is grammar and paragraph completion and interface so you will be giving paragraphs and options to fill into that um, paragraph to make a complete paragraph right another thing is para jumbles so you have so you will be giving four or five sentences in random orders and you have to uh, arrange them so that it will form a story or arrange them in a proper order that means the paradigms another thing is analogies antonyms synonyms one word substitutions and another thing is sentence correction item and phrases so this is not very tough task for us we can tackle this in two weeks right so this is all in verbal reasoning another thing is quantitative aptitude right so the first topic in quantity the aptitude is algebra so a simple algebra will be there averages so the numerical problems from the quantitative attitude are easy you can do it but a little bit tricky and time taking so you should be learning the tricks i will be showing you where to learn from so you can handle this in less time right another thing is equation linear and quadratic geometry of course scf lcm Number system partnership this one is important another thing is percentage this one is also important and uh, gp ap profit and loss reciprocal person and these all things from the quantitative attitude so you can tackle this you know but you need and trick to solve them solve them in less time and these questions are little bit tricky 
Another section is logical reasoning and this logical reasoning includes seating arrangement. So this section may be new to you and after uh, practicing some questions it will be easier. So you have to learn how these problems can be solved. So the problem are seating arrangements, blood relations and this all thing is in logical reasoning. So now another thing you can see is mode of examination is online and duration of time is 19 minutes. So uh, uh, don't think this is too much time. This is very really most uh, less time according to the number of questions because the total number of questions you have will be uh, 90, right? So one mark for each question will be there. Another thing is the type of question is objective type. So you have to take uh, and the most time taking thing in this is this one reading comprehension. So it will take time but of course after reading one paragraph, you can answer four questions uh, uh, related to this one. And this medium of question paper will be English. Here is the subjects, right? Verbal, the number of questions from the verbal section will be 40 and marks will be 40. Quantity 25, 25, logical 25, 25. Total correct uh, mark for correct answer will be 1. And there is no negative marking. So I would recommend whether you know or don't know the method or the answer of each question. But you should take that. Who knows if that was right. Because there is no negative marking. So this is all the um, syllabus we are talking about. So if you are from Nepal. So you may be familiar that this is the syllabus of Lok Seva IQ person. So in Lok Seva Public Service Commission. If you have read something, the IQ section has these things on the right. And another thing is CMAT. So those who are interested in learning the BB or something in Nepal, they may be preparing for CMAT. So the um, syllabus for CMAT is also the same. So the thing is sample paper. So go and exercise this sample paper. So you may have applied for UG candidates. So you may go and practice this sample paper on your own so that you can get a idea how the question will come and how easy or hard for you. So this is all about the syllabus. Now let's talk about the resources I have used during my time. So there are some websites and a YouTube channel I will be recommending you to follow. And the first website with us is India Bix. So just move over to indiabits.com and open this one link and after you go there go for general aptitude and verbal and reasoning you have you don't go for these all things right so just go there and go for arithmetic aptitude and here verbal ability and logical reasoning verbal reasoning and this all section and here only the arithmetic aptitude. After you move to arithmetic aptitude, go and see the syllabus and search and learn. Suppose problems of SCF and LCM. So this one is the problem. If you know the answer, first just try and then view answer. If you uh, here is also the um, required trick. Uh, you can also learn from the trick how it has solved and also you can move to the India Bakes YouTube channel to see the logics. Another website we have is Exam Veda. So Exam Veda has also a lot of things to prepare here. You can go for aptitude, English, reasoning. So you should go for only these three reasons and here is all the topics you need to prepare, right? And another is that all math tricks. So all math tricks is for quantitative aptitude. So move over to this one called quantitative aptitude and you can see all the topics here. And the one YouTube channel I will recommend is this one career ride. So career ride is very nice YouTube channel. I have learned a lot from this during my time. So you can go do uh, go to this and go to playlist and go for quantitative aptitude tutorials, logical reasoning tutorials. This is enough. So this is how all the resources and the websites, YouTube channels I have followed for my examination. And the one best thing you can do is if you have an CMAT book, a book of CMAT which is easily available to any stationery in Nepal. 
So just go and buy or borrow from your student or, or borrow from your friend for few days, only for 14 days and practice from there because practicing from book will help you a lot. I have also done from this Smita publication, CMAT book. I don't know where the book is. So you should prepare from this and this is what all the resources and roadmaps. So this is all for this video guys. If you have any doubts or anything I need to clear further, please comment and you can contact me on Instagram. See you in the next video. Till then take care. Bye bye. And one thing, if you like this video, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Bye bye.